for this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a stats GUI. So all you gotta do is um in so screen GUI. So this is gonna be the open slash close to open you know close this this frame right here. You want to insert another frame, you want to insert a local script in the frame. And you want to insert a text label, and inside that text label, um, just put value right here. Okay. Or oh, yeah, just want to insert another text label, and rename it, uh, value. And also make sure that the text label is also named something like you know your currency. Okay. So first of all, you want to go to the workspace. You want to insert a script. And this script will be your leaderboard. So I've already created it and I, you know, wrote everything in the script. So, so really, what you gotta do is just copy this, you know, into your, into your script. And, and then all you gotta do is just copy this, but instead of you know making it local gold you want to change your gold into like your currency so for example you can rename gold to money and then you'd have to of course rename gold to money for the this bit and also for this bit and that one okay so once you've got that you want to go to your local script and uh, all you got to do is just Basically, type all of this. It's a very short script, so um, yeah. So basically, player equals game dot plays the local player, defining what the player is. What is a player? I don't know. So that's why we defined it. Script dot parent dot goal dot value dot text. So um, the script, its parent is the stats frame dot gold because inside that stats frame we got um the gold text label and inside that gold text label we got um another text label which is called the value and inside that value we got text here and that text equals to the player and then inside that player there will be a folder called leader stats inside that leader stats folder that will be a, like an int value which is going to be called gold and inside that gold value um there will be another little segment that will say value and you know it, it's it's a little bit hard to explain but it's actually not too hard okay so i'm just going to give this a quick test i haven't actually tested out um the script like right now so let's just see if this works i think i have to put an end at the end all right so please load 33 percent okay so it has um yeah, it has loaded. So now let's test this. So as you can see, we've got a folder called Leader Stats Gold. We have to put in an end. And okay. Okay. Wait. Um, I'm going to go into this because I already wrote the script. Alright. Okay. I have to put in this. While wait, colon, uh, not colon, uh, parentheses, parentheses, do, and then put an end. Alright. So I'm pretty sure that should work. And let's also delete 
the script. Alright. It's yeah, I just forgot to put in that. So you're going to players, Frankie Schmidt, leader stats, gold. Now if we change this to one, yes, as you can see, the value changes to one. If we change this to five, it will change. And if we change this to um, whatever this number is. It'll be extremely tiny. It just works like that. And yeah, really, that's it. And of course, there are different methods to do stats GUI. But personally, for me, this would be the easiest one to do. And also, to wrap up the video, we just go into the this button insert object oops okay wait it's uh, object and then we'll put in a local script and inside that we're going to type this up script up here and the mouse button one a colon connect okay uh connect Function. So this means that if the script's parent is um, clicked by a, a computer mouse, something will happen. So and that thing that will happen is script dot parent dot stats. Okay, please load. Dot stats frame. Okay. It didn't come up, so I'm going to have to do this. Can you please load? Dot visible equals not, and we'll just copy this space put it, paste it back in, and now let's just give it another quick test, and this will be the end of the video. Okay, so, uh, search frame is not a valid member. Alright, I forgot to do script parent thought. Alright, okay, hold on. And we will very quickly, I have to put in script parent parent. Alright, so we also got to make this uninvisible. Sorry, that was like an awkward pause there. Just sounds like there's a dog going berserk. Oh wow, it's going really berserk. Okay, so as you can see, this works. And once again, if we go play Frankish Mind, leader stats, gold, we change it, five, boom, it works, and close it. It still works. So like and subscribe, and yeah, bye.